Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Jay Suave back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to be talking about how chase down artists and rim protector can be useful for whatever build you're running with in NBA 2K21. Now, if y'all haven't already, consider subscribing to the channel and liking this video, man. I'm going to be posting more 2K content throughout the year, so consider it, man. You won't regret it if you do. But yeah, anyways, in the gameplay that y'all are about to see in a moment, I'm going to be testing the rim protector and the chase down artist badge all right now first i'm gonna use the chase down artist badge and i'm going to run it without rim protector on all levels with a 35 block rating all right the reason i'm using a 35 block rating is because if you have a high rating of course it's going to work but like i said this build is for everybody so I'm going with a 35 block rating so y'all can see the effects that it has on that particular attribute rating. Now, of course, the higher you go, the more effective it'll be. And for the second part of the video, I'm going to be showing with the rim protector badge. Now, it's only going to be on bronze because, of course, the higher levels you have it, the more effective it will become. So for now, I'm just running it with the bronze rim protector just so y'all can see the difference with and without it all right but yeah let's just get straight into the gameplay man now when i ran without chase down artists equipped i wasn't really getting off the ground at all and understandably i only had a 35 block rating and i don't expect to fly off the court but once i did have the bronze chase down artist as you can see right there i was able to get those leaping animations and that's basically what chase down artist is man it just gives you that explosiveness off the ground to try and get a block but the thing is i wasn't getting any blocks with bronze or silver once i put it to gold i was able to block shots but the thing was it wasn't all the time and i wasn't really you know it wasn't really like oh i'm gonna block it for sure you know what i mean but once i did have bronze chase down artist and rim protector i was able to get those leaping animations as well as block shots consistently and once I went higher with the chase on artist, I was still, you know, it was still improving. You know what I mean? Like gold, I was able to block more shots. And then Hall of Fame, I was able to block even more shots. You know, once I put a Hall of Fame, I felt like LeBron game seven off the glass, Iggy. You know what I mean? Y'all know what I mean, but <laughs> yeah. So basically when you equip these two badges, it's really, it's really powerful because they go hand in hand. You know what I mean? It's like peanut butter and jelly, Kool-Aid and sugar. It's those iconic mixes. And this is one of them, man. And I was testing all this out with a 35 block rating. You know what I mean? So it's not like I was out here with the 80 and I was getting chase downs all the time. Like, no, nah, it was 35. So literally, well, I won't say any build, but almost every build can use this and be effective with it. The only one I wouldn't really say would be that effective with it would be like those 6'2", six, 6'3", six, uh, playmaking shot creators. I mean, they, they're they just offensive gurus, but I mean, I don't really see them using chase down artists, to be honest. They're just too small, but that is the end of the video for today, guys. If you did enjoy it and found it helpful, consider subscribing to the channel and liking this video. I'm going to be dropping more 2K content, so... Go ahead, man. Scratch my back. I'll scratch your back. You know what I mean? We help each other out. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Nah, but for real. Um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. On my final thoughts of it, I would rather put Rim Protector and Chase Down Artist both on rather than only one. You know what I mean? Like, if I have Silver Chase Down Artist, I would take one badge point out. And I put it onto Rim Protector so I could have both of them on bronze. Because what Rim Protector does is gives you that blocking animation. And then Chase Down Artist, what it does is gives you that leaping animation. So you jump higher with Chase Down Artist. And then you'll be able to block more shots with Rim Protector on. And plus, you have the ability to get snatch blocks. And that's really cool because last year I had a slashing playmaker, uh, which was 6'5", and it had like a 30 to 35 block rate i don't remember but i was able to get snatch blocks and chase downs which was pretty odd considering that my blocking rating was so low but like i lay like, y'all know badges run this game but anyway i'm i'm babbling on all right i'll catch you in the next video peace